Alright guys, so this is probably one of the rare occasions where I won't be reviewing shoes. So today, I got a package from Uniqlo, so let's get it going. Yo guys, what's going on? Zakaragi back at it again, and today, I want to do something a little bit different. So, I know you guys are used to me doing my toilet review series. A series where I put a shoe on a toilet, then I review it for you guys out there, but... For today, I wanted to switch it up a little bit because it's been a long ass time. It's the last time I've done one of these videos. So today, we have a small clothing haul for the Uniqlo U Fall Winter 2022 collection. So I've got a couple pieces here, not too many. I didn't want to splurge too much and I told myself that I wouldn't get a lot of clothes because I really don't need that many. So I brought it down to three items that I felt like were the most essential for my wardrobe so we're gonna get into it in a bit before we do don't forget to subscribe to the channel and hit that bell icon as well and like and comment on the video because we're expanding the content a little bit I mean the last time I did one of these clothing haul videos was probably a couple years ago for the Richie Lee collection video link will be up here so it's been a really long time since my last clothing video so I'm super excited to do this one for you guys today but without further ado Let's open up this damn box right here. So where's my box cutter? All right, guys, so I got my box cutter here. So uh, let's get this thing opened. And damn, this is a big box for when I ordered. I don't think it's necessary, but maybe the mic will pick up the, the box cutting sounds. It'll give you guys a little bit of an ASMR here. Wow, I suck at cutting. I missed that. But anyways, whew, here it is. So don't need this right here wow okay so you know let's start it off with the easy one so I'm gonna put this box back down here so ugh, loud thud sorry for all you uh, headphone users out there but okay first thing first is I got this sort of like bucket hat thing from the collection so here it is I thought it was pretty cool to be honest it didn't look like your standard bucket hat in my opinion at least kind of more of a classy vibe so let's put this on hopefully it will uh, look good Bruh. I don't know <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Hey, hey, come on man you know what let me know what you guys think about this in the comments down below I don't really know how this looks right now this is my first time putting it on and obviously there's not a mirror behind my camera so yeah but definitely a cool piece, you know, something I figured I could wear sort of like whenever I didn't want to wear my black fitted baseball cap. So yeah, it's a nice little cool piece here. And yeah, let's move along to the next one here. So what do we have here? Okay. Ooh, I'm going to grab these ones. So, oh, wow. This is, damn, this is like, Bigger than I thought it'd be. Pause. Woof. Woof. That's what she said. Okay, so we have here some pleated. Oh, blah, 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 blah. I can't speak apparently. Some pleated tapered chinos. Um, this is all one take, by the way. I'm not cutting this video. So. This is the next thing from the haul. So I got this in a brown color here. I figured, you know, it's always nice to have a good pair of chinos in the collection and, or wardrobe. This isn't my sneaker collection. This is my wardrobe we're talking about here, but yeah, kind of hard to pick it up on camera. I don't really know what I'm doing. Sorry guys, I am not a fashion YouTuber at all. I do sneaker reviews, so this is gonna be kind of awkward, but these are the pants right here. I'll probably cut to a B-roll shot of me wearing it, but yeah, I figure this is a pretty versatile piece that I can pretty much style with a lot of different things in my wardrobe, kind of dress it up or dress it down type things. So definitely was much needed, and I actually don't own a pair of chinos right now, so definitely a good addition but that is the second piece in the collection that I got and finally the last but not least wow this is heavy okay so we have the cardigan from the Uniqlo U collection um, actually you know what I was realizing right now I'm saying Uniqlo, but at the beginning of the video I said Uniqlo. I really don't know how it's really pronounced, so uh, don't flame me in the comments, don't tweet me. I'm new to this uh, little thing here, but whatever. But this is the cardigan that I got. Wow, this is pretty nice actually. Damn. 
I'm pretty glad that I got this because I've been on the market for a pretty good cardigan and in the brown color as well. I mean, I've just been all over wearing brown recently. Maybe I'm just falling for the trends, but yeah, this is pretty nice. I'll probably cut to a shot of me wearing this in a B-roll shot or whatever, but yeah, I'm pretty impressed with this. It has a good weight to it. Feels really soft in hand and uh, yeah, the material feels really nice. This is made out of lamb's wool, if I'm not mistaken. And yeah, I can't, oh, here. Premium lamb's wool ribbed v-neck cardigan. So that is the official uh, title for this piece right here. Definitely another versatile piece that I can dress up and dress down and wear on the daily. So definitely needed in my wardrobe. So yeah, so I actually got all these pieces as a whole because I could actually wear them as a fit together. So I'll probably cut to a shot of me wearing them all together. But obviously these pieces can be worn with many different things in my wardrobe. So that is why I got them specifically. But there are a ton of other items in the collection from the Uniqlo U Fall Winter 2022 edition that I felt like I could have bought as well, but it took all my willpower not to buy them. But that is it for today's video, guys. Thank you so much for watching so let me know what you think about this kind of content if you like it if you don't i know it's different from the sneaker reviews so for all you people out there that are sub to my channel specifically for sneaker reviews i'm sorry i wanted to switch it up a little bit and you know i like making content it's fun i want to do things that i enjoy so doing videos like this is something that i do enjoy so yeah if you don't like it you don't have to stay i'm not going to force you but that is it for today, guys. Now that it's that part of the video, it's time for hashtag Zakaragi. Let's rockin'. And I'm actually rocking these guys back here for today. Uh, these are the Jound A6 Gel Kayano 14s. So one of my favorite shoes of this year so far. At first, I wasn't really impressed with them, but now I am after wearing them for one month because my one month wear update video should be coming out soon. So I'll probably link it up here once that is uploaded. But that is it for today, guys. I'm signing out. Peace.